What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. We about to get into uh, Jessica video with Runic leaked. I don't know, voice, let's get it. Jessica is being put on blast by a Runic crew member. Someone in the group messaged Messy Mod a video of Jessica and Runic kissing. Remember Jessica said that her and Runic were just friends and that he was there just for her sister. But the Runic crew member is saying that's a lie. The person said that Runic really went out of town to see Jessica and Sierra Runic's baby mama claimed they're still messing around on the low. Now Jessica is supposed to be dating Deshae's brother Mel Mel, but according to the receipts the crew member is dropping, Jessica still could be messing around with Runic. Now, supposedly the quote unquote I lie. She kissed him with no remember problem. is dropping. Jessica still could be messing around with Runic. Now they both turn their face to do that. Now, supposedly the quote unquote truth is coming out is because she the lying. crew member is leaving the Runic crew. So they decided to put Runic and Jessica on blast. But people are saying this possibly could be Runic behind all of this because he's upset that she's messing with Mel Mel when he has been giving her money and taking care of her. And she now is messing with another dude. So he's upset. Brother, they said that you was kissing Jessica. They said that you was just, you was kissing Jessica the prankster and she was what? Child about the whole situation, boy. J Runic, I tried to tell him. I tried to tell him that video was edited. They didn't want to believe me. <laughs> and they said that I was lying. Boy, I tried to convince him, boy. I tried, Runic. I tried with all my might. I did. You got to be more careful. People are going into your MacBook. Your MacBook and sending things to themselves. I know, so... Going into the MacBook is crazy. So, Sierra, let me ask you a question, right? Yeah. Let me ask you a question. Do you think, do you think purposely that these videos is getting out there on purpose? Yes. Do you think purposely that these videos is getting out there on purpose? Who do you think is the, 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 the evil root behind it all? Runic. It's Runic. You think it's Runic, folks? You think it's Runic? Yes, because he already said, he already said that, uh, he already talking about, um, man, because her sister called me, her sister called me on FaceTime on Instagram, and her sister was pretty much airing everything out, talking about Runic pretty much being a sugar daddy to her, and that he'd been buying her hella bags and shit. I go back and told Runic, I guess he felt played that she said that, so he's like, man, this shit finna come out, like, you finna see the, the shit. So I'm thinking that this nigga made a fake page, sent that shit, and then, you know, since he felt played about what her sister said, because her sister was like, oh, I don't fuck with Runic. Like, I really didn't like his vibes. Like, and then, like, Jessica was pretty much like, just, you know, they was fucking with each other. Like, you know, they Wait, was Wait, how recent other, was but... this? Huh? This is literally, she called me yesterday on FaceTime. On Instagram. Hmm. So Man. I think her and her sister have beef right now, because, like, the way her sister was talking to me, like spilling me all the tea. Oh yeah, like um, I think they 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 must be beefed up. Like I'm pretty sure that's why she moved out. Like, cause I think they were probably staying together or something. Like, cause she was like, me and my sister Not live probably. two different lives. Like I, Sierra really talking about probably. She know they stay together. Baby mama went oh, live was. with Messy Maj last night. Definitely go check out Messy Maj page. The links is down below. Sierra said on a live that Jessica's sister reached out to her because Jessica and her sister are no longer talking. That's why Jessica moved out of the place with her sister and got her own place because her and her sister are not cool anymore. So Jessica's sister being mad reached out to Sierra and was spilling tea about Runic and Jessica. Now the sister said that Jessica and Runic were the one that was really talking and that she never talked to Runic at all. She said that Runic was buying Jessica bags, paying her rent, giving her money and that's why Jessica continued talking to Runic and Jessica told Runic that Mel Mel was just content and that it was nothing serious. So he believed- I believe this it up until the sister spilt all this tea the sister told sierra sierra went back and told runic and now runic feel like he's played in the situation because i was in my, my own circle on some snake ish I don't want to talk shit blew me as up. Because him and Jessica behind the scenes are really supposed to be together. Not her and Mel Mel. Man, because her it. sister called me. Her sister called me. I, I don't believe. He, I think he probably did leak it. On That's FaceTime, on Instagram. And her sister was pretty much airing everything out. Talking about Runic pretty much being a sugar daddy to her. And that he'd been buying her hella bags and shit. I go back and told Runic. I guess he felt played that she said that. So he's like, man, this shit finna come out. Like, you finna see the, the shit. So I'm thinking that this nigga made a fake page, shit that shit, and then, you know, since he felt played about what her sister said, because her sister was like, oh, I don't fuck with Runic. Like, I really didn't like his vibes. Like, 
And then, like, Jessica was pretty much, like, just, you know, they was fucking with each other. Like, you know, they Wait, was Wait, how recent other, was but, this? Huh? This is literally, she called me yesterday on FaceTime. On Instagram. Hmm. So I think her and her sister have beef right now. Because, like, the way her sister was talking to me, like, spilling me all the tea... Oh yeah, like um, I think they 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 must be beefed up. Like I'm pretty sure that's why she moved out. Like, cause I think they were probably staying together or something. Like, cause she was like, me and my sister live two different lives. Like, I be trying to give her advice, like to not fuck with nobody's baby daddy, but Jessica <laughs> doesn't listen. Like, she really just doesn't care. Like, she been talking to Rooney. She been talking to Rooney, and she's really talking to him because he keeps buying her things. He's paying her rent. He, you know, he. She was saying all that. She playing her role. That's all. And this is the sister. This is the sister that you allegedly talked about the child when yeah. y'all got into it. Yeah, yeah. And she called you for, like she called you willingly and just told you everything yes. that's going on. Yes. What the fuck? Literally. So you think that? See, you think, I think that her and her sister, sister got a problem right now? I think her and her sister are not like <laughs> probably not cool right now because the way she was like willingly spilling tea. Like, she was like, I really don't like drama, but I'm just like... Or she was jealous, y'all. Let me tell y'all, this is the season. It's been a season, but some people don't understand until something happened. Stop trusting people that's jealous of you. It's a good thing her sister moved on because she's jealous of her. You know, I'm just going to tell you, like, what it is. Like, Runic and her been, like, talk, like she told me every fucking thing, like I'm telling you. And I went back and told Runic, and Runic felt played about that shit. So Runic, so do you think Runic somewhat threw you underneath the bus? About what? Because it was a text message and someone went back and told Jessica that I'm planning on doing a video, which is not true, but they said that I'm planning on doing the video. Um, and a lot of people think Runic was the only one that was in here that has communications with Jessica. So it kind yeah, of makes it feel like Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Yeah, cause yeah, that ain't got nothing to do with me. Child, so you just was, you was just trying to help your baby daddy in a sense. Yeah, no. cause shit, I low key felt bad for him when he. Sh yeah, cause yeah, that ain't got nothing to do with me. Why? Why does she feel bad for him? I'm yeah. confused. Child, so and why can I not find? You just was you was just oh. trying to help your baby daddy in a sense. Yeah. Cause shit, I low key felt bad for him when she said that shit. Like this nigga out here getting shitted on, stunted on, and shit. Like, damn, like bro. But she shit on him and stun on him all the time. Well, that's fucked up. So of course I'm gonna refer the message. But at the end of the day, like me and him, we after that shit that came out yesterday, how he was talking shit about me. Like I didn't really have to tell him that shit that her sister said, but I just felt like saying it honestly because I low key felt embarrassed for him myself. So mm -hmm. bitch. I threw that shit right up in his face. I ain't gonna lie, but shit, <laughs> look how this shit came Talking out about today. Talking you looking, looking out for him. Cap. Hot. Shit Child. it on him. Shit this it on him. This shit. But why do you feel bad for him when he never feel bad for you? I don't That's really all I'm saying. I necessarily feel bad for him. I'm, I'm more so like feel embarrassed for him. I'm not gonna lie. I don't fucking know that. At the end of the day, that is my baby daddy. I feel embarrassed for that nigga because this nigga just got clowned. But that's his karma, and that bitch is barely, that bitch deserves to be slapped too. So when I come to Orlando, bitch, I'm gonna slap the fuck out of that bitch. I want to beat the fuck out of that hoe. So I, I hope she ready for me. I ain't gonna lie, cause I'm gonna be out there real, real fucking soon. And but I'm not even gonna say all that on this TikTok, you, cause I know how they get. Dude, we gotta get, we gotta get into it tomorrow, cause we. This, yeah, we gotta get into it tomorrow. I don't really got time to talk a lot on on this yeah, live like this. It's crazy. This is crazy. We gotta get. But really nah, cause today. people was playing in my face, trying to make it seem like Sierra's a victim. This girl is not innocent. She tries to seem like she's innocent online and shit. I hate people like that. I, I agree with this part though. Clearly, Jessica is not innocent. She do seem like a a little liar. Hey. Snake ass. This girl literally, like I said, bro, she, like, for two years straight now, this girl was send me stuff of Rooney, trying to be cool with me. Like, I don't, and then as soon as she fucking with Rooney, she's saying, oh, we were never friends. Girl, I hate girls like that. I hate snakes like that, bro. That's why I don't even fuck with people for real. Like, that girl is straight up a snake. And y'all felt for all that bullshit she was putting in y'all's heads. But at the end of the day, bro, if I feel played, <laughs> bitch, I feel played, and I'm going to slap the fuck out of that bitch when I see her. So I hope. She take a flight oh. to Houston, or I'll take a flight out there. Cause when I see her, it's up. Mm. Uh, it's forever gonna be up with me. I ain't gonna lie, she doing a lot, and she'll be the one to not fight when she see her and want to talk. 
And granted, I, I've never seen Sierra fight. I've, I've never even seen her be about that life. So I don't know. Maybe she is. You know what I'm saying? I'm, but I'm just saying it's kind of like, it's kind of, you you clown them too. Like, you know what I'm saying? You're not on his side for real. So I don't really understand that part. That part I'm really not understanding. Um, what else happened? It's, it's a video that's two minutes. Kaysen at reaction. But no, no, no. What is this video right here? Runic kissing was leaked on the internet. If you have not watched my. This why she kissed Runic. Okay, let's get into this. A video of Jessica and Runic kissing was leaked on the nah, internet. Burberry a fool. If you have not watched my previous video, definitely go check that video out because Jessica's own sister exposed <laughs> her. That link is popping up as well as is down below. But in this video, Jessica talks about the kiss and everything else. You're you're gonna you're gonna you're gonna get lit. So I'm lit. My friend my friends were were there. Okay, we already seen this. So she put that in there too. That's fine. All morning, and I still can't comprehend. Yeah, she can't comprehend it. Kaysenet right. reaction to Charlemagne revealing that he almost got cussed out by Tyler for mentioning Kaysenet during the interview after her team told the Breakfast Club not to. Here's Kaysenet reaction. Charlemagne, Charlemagne says Tyler's team said not to ask any Kaysenet. Oh! I ain't gonna lie, Charlemagne is crazy. Oh shit! I'm told y'all. Oh my gosh! You guys broke her! That's not motion. No, no, no. Okay. That's not motion. It's just so much people. I don't blame them. I don't blame them. I don't blame them. I, I know she hates it now, bro. She told me it's she's she's it's tiring, bro. It's it's all Kevin's fault. It's Kevin's fault. We it's Kevin's fault, bro. We friends though. They didn't want us to ask about Kai tonight. <laughs> I don't I don't blame her team. Kasanat. But not wanting to ask about me. I like 100%, bro. I don't blame her team for that. That's that's actually a good. That's actually good. Cuz it could get crazy, bro. You know what it is? I don't think people understand like like the full streaming culture, bro. Like, bro, it's a big ass audience, bro. That's it's too big, bro. It's so fucking big. <laughs> Chat, this force and this power, it's too much power. <laughs> Chat, slow down. Allegedly, DDG flew to Paris with Lala. People are saying that their pictures and videos are in similar places. They both were at the same event. They even wore matching outfits. And according to this blog, DDG been messing around with Lala for a while. They also was in Miami together as well. Her name was on the bowling alley screen. Now, Lala used to be signed to DDG Zooted Company, and she also was the one that hooked DDG and Ruby up back in 2020. Actually, before Ruby met DDG, Lala made it clear that she didn't want to be no more than friends with DDG. And at the time, DDG was single. He had money he had his Rolls Royce. So if Sis wanted to mess with DDG, that was the perfect time to do so. Sis was in the mix before Ruby Rose came in the picture. Ruby Rose made it clear recently that she is single again. Her and Juicy- Child, DDG is not about the please. You are done. Favorite love song? Um, wow. fuck love. Okay, I'm single, guys. Oh, oh I'm gonna love for that. <laughs> but Ruby is now with Ty Lil in Paris and I love that for them. Oh, yeah, I don't think Ty Lil and Ruby on that type of time, but you <laughs> could be wrong but I'm, I'm just happy Tyler out here handling his business getting his moolah I like that all right y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below I'm over here looking at Kai's dream his house the way he got it set up he's so creative um I'm working on some things see the difference between me and Kai is I'm not 21 you know what I'm saying so my mindset is not there I'm more so on Duke type time and that's why Duke moved totally different than Kai <laughs> but um <laughs> <laughs> that age difference is a thing but he handles his business but we are gonna make this streamer thing fun y'all just give me a second but i love y'all appreciate y'all hey